Well, hello wherever you are. My name's Dave, and you are watching Andromeda's Travels. We've got this thing about um, being able to camp or park or sleep or whatever off grid. And of course, doing that requires that you have power. You might want your hair straightened or your hair dry or something like that, or you might also decide that what you want is uh, a nice cup of coffee from something like Tatimo or an espresso or whatever. So I went hunting about to see what I could find. Let me share with you what I found. And it's this. This is uh, from Hyundai and it's uh, an HPS 1100. And it is, as you might be able to see, a power supply. It's 11, what is it, 110 amp hours is this thing and comes with um, everything you would need, I think. So let's switch it on. And I've, I've just recharged it this morning. Um, so we're at 100% as you can see on here. And I think it's time, it's now time to remove that little piece of plastic. It's now at 100% and it comes with um, 230 volts on these two here and these are actually two pinners uh, with a three pin connection going either way up so it doesn't matter where you are whether you're in the UK or wherever and 12 volt the usual kind of 12 volt socket that we're all used to cigarette lighter sockets people call them and then two further 12 volt outs here these are um, 5 amps each this is 10 amps then you've got one, two, three, four standard USBs and a USB-C. And they are switchable. Um, so up here, you have a switch for your DC on. That's your 12 volt. There it goes. And a switch for AC on, 230 volts. So off we go. And there's a little timer, as you'll see down here, that's a, that lets you know how long it's been running. Um, and also shows you how many watts there are being taken. I don't know whether you'll be able to see that. I'll try and zoom in if I can. Um, so that shows you how much power is being taken. Let's just switch those off. And uh, go a little bit further. Charging time on this thing is around about 20 hours from completely flat to a full charge. There or thereabouts. Um, and it charges in two ways. One is via a kettle plug from the mains, uh, which is as you would expect. And the other way is via a solar panel uh, or 12 volts from your car or van. It'll, it'll run to up to 24 volts. So you can charge it when you're on the road, when you're on hookup, anywhere you like. And it's grand. Now, I've already mentioned this on videos that have come earlier on this channel and I've used it with my astrophotography equipment quite successfully, thank you. And indeed, it will run at um, one amp hour per hour, or yeah, roughly speaking. So 1% of its, of its um, charge per hour with my astrophotography equipment. And that draws, obviously, around about an amp on average over the course of an hour while it's moving the telescope and taking photographs and stuff like that. But what's interested me is whether or not this thing will work to make coffee using the Tassimo machine that my darling daughter kindly loaned us and which she's not getting back if it works. And I thought you might like to come with me on that adventure. So shall we have a go and see, shall we? Shall we? Go on then, let's. Well, so, right, here we go. 113 amp plug, um, which I'm gonna put in on that side. I'm going to turn the AC on. AC's on, lovely. So now we've got the beep to tell us. I don't know whether you push that down under there. You might be able to see what's going on here. So we have AC on. So now we need to switch the unit on. So far, fine. We're not taking very much power at all. So I need to lift this, take that out. What I'm going to do is have a Costa Latte other silly drinks are available no i don't want a cadbury's one what's that that's the lot here bit and the milk 
shaky bit. So it says here, shake. So I'm shaking. That goes in that way up. Like that. So far so good. It's ready to go, look. Now, will my mug fit? It does. Right, we press the button and we'll see. Ah, it overloaded it. It overloaded it, so it won't actually, its start up is higher. Ah, such a shame. Such a shame. Ah well, that can only mean one thing. It'll only run when we hook up. So let's go back to being hooked up. So there you are. That's uh, that's a major disappointment, I have to say. I'm majorly disappointed. Do any of you know anything that will run? Because this is a thousand watts continuous, two thousand watts peak. That's thirteen hundred watts. Obviously, twenty six hundred watt peak, um, which is a bit of a shame. Such a shame. I had thought that would have worked, and obviously I was wrong. So yes, if anybody knows of a Nespresso or a Tassimo or whatever it is, Imo, that is out there that will run from a thousand watts, a kilowatt rather than two kilowatts or thirteen hundred watts or anything like that. Could you please let me know in the comments down below, because I do like me coffee, and well, it is what it is, isn't it? Yes, it's heating up and pumping at the same time, so it's obviously drawing a lot of uh, a lot of current at that point in time. But there you go. <sighs> now, to sum up on on this Hyundai piece of kit, I have to say, I love the sound of coffee being made. I have to say it served me very well for what I want to do. Um, I'll come back and tell you more about it as we find out whether things will or won't work. Um, but I'm really quite impressed by it. If you can get a discount on it, and I did, um, you can probably pick it up for about 850, something like that, maybe 800 quid, which seems like an awful lot. But when I tell you that I've been unable to find something that will run my astrophotography gear at a reasonable price that isn't the weight of a, a lead, you know, a full blown lead acid battery. Um, this weighs in at about eight and a half kilos, so it's not that heavy. It's certainly a lot easier to carry about than a lead acid battery is, and it works very, very well, thank you. It'll work down to minus 10 degrees at least, um, and anything up to plus 40, so it's all good. Uh, charges in a number of different ways, is very portable, it works very nicely. It just won't run me Tassimo! <laughs> anyway, hope you found it useful. If you have, thumbs up please, leave a comment down below, subscribe, click the little bell icon, ding ding, and then any more nonsense that gets posted up on this channel you'll be notified about and it'll be all good. Okay? Grand. I will see you on the flip side, as it were, in the next video. Until then, enjoy the roads, enjoy the stars, enjoy your life. See you later.